Hello, hello, hello. I'm going to show you what the language choice object is and how you can use it. If you want your users to find your website in different languages, this is the correct choice. We've created a template in two different languages. This is the English. And with the language choice object, I can change it into Chinese. Here it is. Let me show you how we've done this with Website X5. First of all, I created the English project with everything I wanted inside it, including the object in its own header. Once it was finished, I hit duplicate and created the Chinese project. I opened it and changed all the text into Chinese. Now I'm going to open the English project and show you where the object is. Go into Template, Template Content, the header section, and here it is. If you don't know where to find it in the object list, please go into Manage, Utility, and you'll find it in the list. You can download it and hit OK. Let's open it now to see how it's made. This is the English project. And this is the Chinese I have opened before. You can add up to eight different languages in this section. We have added two. Our first language is English. Our second language is Chinese. This is the English project, so this is going to be the current language and I'm going to check this box. In this project, Chinese is the current language, so this box has to be checked. You can also pick your flag in the drop-down list. If you cannot find it, you can place your own file. Once you've done this, you can choose your style, add a background colour, your text colour, your font type, and do it exactly as you want it. Once this has been done, go into step 5 and upload your website to the internet. Please remember to do two different files, one for the English website and one for the Chinese. Once it's been uploaded to the internet, you need your URL address. You go back into the project, you open the object, and you need to add the URL to the website. Here it is. You need Chinese, so in the English project, I'm going to add the Chinese URL. Meanwhile, in the Chinese project, I'm going to add the English URL. And that's it. Your website is ready in two different languages. I hope you like this. If you have any questions, please contact our Help Centre.